Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another unboxing video from the Gamer Shack. Today I'm doing this a little bit different. I'm actually recording this on my phone. I don't know what's happened with my laptop, but I've just installed a new update. Fucking Windows 10. And it won't let me record video anymore. I don't know why. I don't get it. But whatever. So anyway, I don't know how this is going to turn out. It might be alright, it might be crap, but you know, we'll go with it. Anyway, we have a sci-fi block. So, those of you who aren't aware of sci-fi block is, it's a monthly subscription service from the guys over at Nerdblock. You get five to six items a month, depending. Let's have a look. I can't remember what we got this month, but I seem to recall there were things in it which I was quite looking forward to. So, yeah, we'll see. Hmm. Okay. So, we have a Star Wars item. And we have a Death Star Ice Mold. So, as I'm looking at this, it's backwards. So, I don't know if it's going to be backwards when I record, when, you know, by the time I mess about with it and edit it. I think my editing software, if that works, I can flip it so it shouldn't be an issue. We'll see. Anyway, there's the inside of that bit, inside of that bit. Don't know how that's going to come up. So, yeah. We have a patch and a temporary tattoo. I've no idea what these are from. I'll see on the card in a bit, but I've no idea what they're from. We have a Star Trek, like a mini lunchbox. Don't really care for Star Trek, don't really care for that. Okay, so this is an X-Files item. I don't quite know what this is. I'm guessing it's... What is it? I'm guessing it's like a lunch bag of some sort. So, yeah. Uh, I'll have to read this this way, because like I say, it's in reverse on my camera, on my screen on my phone, so... Uh, U.S. Department of Justice, Federal Bureau of Investigations, X-Files, uh, Chain of Custody Mulder. I assume these will have some sort of significance to the show if you took that much notice of case files and stuff. And then inside, I don't know if you can see that, but it's um, sort of like insulated. So you can put hot stuff, cold stuff, seal it up. No, you can fold it. That way. There you go. So something like that. We have a comic. Doctor Who. Uh, don't care for Doctor Who. Have an art print. Oh, I also have. Two ten pound credit cards this month, but I don't use them anyway. So whatever. Uh, yeah. So our print, and with that we've got uh, Princess Leia, Lilo, Star Trek woman. Not quite sure who that is, and Ripley. Oh, T-shirt. Lake Oka Bogey. I'm guessing that's like a with it saying I want to believe on it as well. I'm assuming this is a X Files related, but I don't recall. This is probably like yeah. 
This month's nerd box seemed to have sucked. Uh, yeah, so. Ah, Starship Troopers is where they're from. So. Yeah. Pitching that as like the main item. X Files t shirt. Uh, if we can focus on that. Star Wars Ice Mold. Next month, Judge Dredd, Mystery Science Theatre, Jurassic Park. Yeah, this month's blog seems to have been shit. Yeah. I've cancelled all my blocks anyway, like, because it was annoying me with the amount of time that they're taking to come. It's like, this arrived in the UK on Wednesday. It cleared customs in the UK on Wednesday. Today's Tuesday, and I've only just got it. And so that's kind of a factor to it. Prices have gone up due to sort of currency change. Uh, you complain about it and they don't really do anything about it. They did offer me 25% off when I was cancelling. And then I had a conversation with one of the customer care team. And they offered me 50% off for a 6 or 12 month uh, subscription. To which I was like, I, mean, I don't really want to pay that much up front. Because I had four. You know, so that would be a hell of a lot of money to pay out in one go. Especially at the minute when I'm paying around about... Well, I've cancelled over a lot, so I've paid about £160 a month, which is about $200. I mean, it's just too much. And coupled with the fact that, you know, it take ages to come. And half the things in them I don't overly care for. I like the nerd blocks because usually the nerd block stuff is pretty good. Like you get some decent exclusive items in there, but um, I also get a load of things I don't care for. So I'm often stuck with the box full of stuff. When I say a box full, I mean a big box full. I used to sell things on eBay, like, but I've kind of got a bit bored with that now because uh, it takes ages to do. So. By the time I've listed everything, like, you know, you make, when you paid your fees, you're not really getting that much of a return. So, yeah, I kind of threw the towel in for that. And the whole mystery box thing as well, I think I said in my Nerdbot Classic video, I've kind of lost, um, you know, my enjoyment out of it now. Because a lot of them just tend to throw in just random filler items. You get a decent item. Personally, I'd rather have two or three good items. Than like five or six items where bits you just don't care for. Uh, yeah, so just a bit bored of them at the minute. I'm just not enjoying them, shall I say. So I thought I'll give it a. I was saying that though, when I looked at the card for next month in Nerdbot Classic, uh, that looked pretty good. And my girlfriend said, oh. I've already got through like a teaser email for next month's horror block and that was pretty good. The teaser card for next month's uh, classic was pretty good. So you know now that I've cancelled them I'm going to get good, you know there's going to be good items and I'm going to be good because I've cancelled them but it's too much money to be spending each month. You work that out over the course of a year. So I've still kept on popping a box because popping a box is something that you get every month that you want. I say, you know, you put in what you want and they send you based on, you know, your list of what you want. Whereas with this, you know, half of stuff, so Star Trek, don't care for. Starship Troopers, don't care for. So, you know, and then there's other items like, you know, my nerd box classic still here. Yeah. Not even bothered with this because I've just not like that. Don't care for. Don't care for. Attack on Titan. Don't care for. So, just wasting money. But anyway, if you know you do fancy getting one of them, I'll put a link in the description below. Pop along, check it out. You can subscribe to any of the nerd blocks from there. So anyway, thanks for watching. See you again soon.
Tchau, tchau.